Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'da habita fillah The Prophet alayhi salatu wa sallam said al-Muslim akhul Muslim yashidduhu ba'dhu ba'dhu The Muslim is a believer uh, the believer the believers are brothers and they strengthen one another they strengthen one another and we know all the ayat and the ahadith of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam urging us to assist one another and assist our brothers and sisters during times of trials and tribulations and difficulty. And that this Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will remove difficulty from you if you remove the difficulty from your believing Muslim brother or sister. And... Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says fi kitab al-kareem wa anfiqu mimma razaqnakum min qabl an ya'ti ahadakum al-mawt fa yaqulu rabbi lawla akhartni ila ajalin qareeb fa asaddaqa wa akun min as-salihin Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says fi kitab al-kareem and he and this is in the imperative form he commands us wa anfiqu mimma razaqnakum spin from that which we have provided for you before Death comes upon you, and you and he uh, and before one for death comes upon one of you, and he says, "My Lord, if only you had given me give me a little more time, and I would give sabaka, I would give charity, and I would be of the sadhim." So it shows that we need to spend and do righteous deeds before it's too late. And so I want to mention an appeal on behalf of a brother that I didn't know. A brother who I only heard about who was known to be from those from Ahlul Sunnati wal Jama'ah and known to be a person of good manners. And we ask that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blesses him with genital verdose and forgives him of his sins. And so our dear brother, Maceo Cleaver, Rahmatullahi alayhi rahmatin wasiya, he passed just this past week at the age of 49. And he left behind a very large family, many children, and I believe he had three wives. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have mercy upon him and bless his family and bless them with patience and heal their hearts, and provide for them. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. And I will read some of the, the details as it was sent to me. And just a little bit of background. This brother, and this is what I do know is, and why I had known of him, is because his both of his parents were well-known uh, black revolutionaries from the 60s. Eldridge Cleaver and Catherine Cleaver, and they were both big members of the Black Panther Party. So they were civil rights, and they, civil rights, fought for civil rights, and they were known. So he was born in this type of setting, a setting of a very strong identity. However, he, by the permission of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, embraced Islam. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guided him to the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And... It was sent to me, it said, on the night of October 18th, 2018, equivalent to the night of Yom, Yom Juma, a beloved brother of ours known as Ahmed Maceo Eldridge Cleaver, left this world to return to his creator at the age of 49. Ahmed was counting down the days to leave Saudi Arabia so he could return to America to take care of his mother and family, yet it was written that his life would be taken in the manner it was, and at the time it was. Our brother died on a hospital bed as a result of heart difficulties and left behind three widows and 13 children who are now orphaned. From the blessing of Allah, he died on the night of Jumwa, which we hope means and makes him from those who escaped the fitna of the grave. And furthermore, he was preyed upon in Masjid al-Haram by tens of thousands of people in Mecca. And 
we know all the admonitions from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam to take care of the orphans and to spend. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says Kitab al Kareem about spending and spending from what we He has provided us with. Alif Lam Mim Dalik al Kitab Allah Rayba fi Hudin al Muttaqin Aladina Yukminuna Bil Ghaibi wa Yukimuna Salat wa Mimma Razakana Hum Yunfikun. And from what we have provided them, they spend. So I'm encouraging myself. And encourage my brothers and sisters to even if it's one dollar, if it's one real, if it's one pesos, wherever you live, if you can donate something. And I'm going to put a link to this brother's, uh, it's not a GoFundMe, it's a, a launch good page. I'm going to put that on the, the video. Uh, and we ask that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has mercy and blesses his with Jannah to Firdos and takes care of his family and provides for them and may Allah bless us to be a source of good and to be a part of that wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam